storms and flash floods turned roads into gushing rivers and swamped homes with waist-high muddy water across the Kenyan capital, Nairobi, killing at least 10 people. The East Africa region has been lashed by relentless downpours in recent weeks as the El Nino weather pattern exacerbates the seasonal rainfall. Across Nairobi, vehicles were stranded in the deluge and people waded through floodwaters in slum areas to reach safety. According to the Nairobi County Governor's Office, an estimated 60,000 people, mostly women and children, have been severely affected by the floods. The Kenya Meteorological Department warned that heavy to very heavy rainfall was forecast in various parts of the country until May. In one incident on Wednesday, police fired tear gas to disperse angry residents who had blocked a main highway with long queues of cars calling for government action over the floods. Kenya Railways announced it was temporarily suspending commuter train services, while the roads authority said four roads in the capital had been partly closed. Homes were engulfed in the sprawling Nairobi slum of Matha, where residents took to rooftops to save their lives and belongings. The Red Cross said the Afi River, the second longest in Kenya that runs south of Nairobi to the Indian Ocean, had burst its banks blocking roads and leaving residents stranded. In central Nairobi, where many government offices and the parliament are based, a main avenue was blocked by fallen trees.